of the evening, honey. Why, I'll say our party was a great success. Didn't Mrs. Smith look stunning? And did you notice Mrs. Jones' new dress? She looks lovely. What do you, Mrs. Brown? Mr. Brown say to Uncle Benny? Just one of those things, honey. He had a few too many. They sure were a hungry crowd. I'll say they didn't leave a scrap for poor little Rover. We ought to be real proud. Mm-hmm. I'm mighty glad the dancing's over. No more company to be. And there's no more papers left to read. What's to do about it? Let's put out the lights and go to sleep. All right. <laughs> Gosh, I'm tired. No more anything to drink. Oh, I'll leave those dishes in the sink. All right, baby. What's to do about it? Simply nighty-night and so to sleep. You're waiting now for me to say I love you. Why, oh, you know, you're looking younger every day. You never wear so sweet before, dear. You wouldn't call me Not now. much, uh -huh. Mary. No more money in the bank. No cute baby we can prevent. Well, what's to do about it? Let's put out the lights and go to sleep. There's no more people in the flat. Oh, my gosh, Mr. Brown has gone and left his hat. Well, again, yeah. what's to do about it? Say, hey, Mary, that's beyond a joke. You said it. Well, what are we going to do about it? Let's say nighty-night and start to sleep, honey. All right. You know, Mary, yeah. your Aunt Eliza looks an awful wreck. Your mother was the biggest fright here. Teddy there, I'd like to break your father's neck. Oh, shut up. Your Uncle Joe's a perfect nightmare. All right. All right. You know you're getting sore with me now, you know. Well, this finishes it out. There'll be no more sitting up your sleep. All right, honey. Well, what's to do about it? Oh, <laughs> Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs>